Hey yo, I'm Andy and welcome to Odd Podge, where we leave fate to RNG and decorated island catered to the infamous autofill villager because this is a 30 day autofill challenge. Yesterday we spruced up our villagers yards giving them a lot of color and a lot of personality. So let's get in to day 26. Wow, okay. So I got a little bit of dilemma happening in here because a couple of days ago, three or four days ago, Frida was like, are you going to do your island at night or doing during the day? Because at night, the glowing moss glows and the stars glow. And then I was like, okay, I can travel and play with some time and all that and see what's going on. Now I just have a dilemma. So it is 5 a.m. And 5 a.m., the sky is this like turquoisey green and it looks so toxic and everything has this like little shimmer to it, but it's dark and there's not a lot of shadows going on and there's just a lot of profile like in the background there. It's just this dark profile of a palm tree and a shell. Come a little closer, you can see, but the glowing moss, the glowing moss glows. It's glowing right? The stirs, the stirs glow. They're glowing. So I'm going to come up here and show you our little secret area and show you what that, this is looking like at this time of day, right? Like everything is glowing and then the sky is kind of dark and the, it, it's a little mystical and I, I kind of like it. I kind of like it. But also the day will get brighter and keeps on getting brighter as time goes on. So eventually, I guess the sun would come up. Maybe I could do like 5.30, but but 5.30 looks pretty much the same as five o'clock. It just gets lighter a bit quicker, I suppose. There's this time, right? Which I think is super cool. And then there's this time, which is 6.45, and the sun will continue to lower and it'll continue to get darker, but the stars still glow and the moss still glows, right? There's more shadows, but it the sky's not green. The sky's like a pinkish color, which is kind of cool too. And everything looks so nice and just happy and serene when you're not in like a toxic wasteland. I'll show you the background too so you still get those kind of profiles those dark profiles as you walk away but they're not as sharp so it's kind of nicer and when you walk around the island like the pumpkin patch is a little nicer but you see it still glows right also I could do seven o'clock it'll be just slightly darker than this but the sun will still be setting and things are kind of more of a secret too when you walk up to them during these times of day. And then Graham's area is like super glowy and things are just happening, right? You know, you got that sunset in the back, which is super cute, but the sky's not green. So I just, <laughs> I don't know. Also, I did consider this time, which is literally midnight, the glowing moss really, really glows. <laughs> As you can see, things are glowing. This is bright, but there's that like weird shine on the ground from the moon. I mean, I just don't think dirt is shiny, <laughs> you know, and, and things kind of look two dimensional, I suppose, but things do glow. And then the second problem with midnight is like the orchard just looks abandoned and you know it's not Stella takes care of it I mean yeah like look at how glowy that moss ball is but then all of the glow patches that I've put on the ground they kind of just disappear with that weird like there is literally a glow patch under the stick right in front of me but you can barely see it because of that weird shine so I did consider I did consider midnight. There's just too many cons for it. Though it is nice and the, and the galaxy and the stirs and everything, it all looks nice. Pig pen with the pigs, you know, running around. Yeah, I can see them running around early morning or late afternoon before they go to bed, but not at night, you know? There's that. And then also there is always the choice of this time which is midday the same time that we've been basically playing on the entire time i mean give or take a couple hours between 9 and and 12 ish i guess i've been setting the time 
I mean, we've seen it all. This is this is what I've been playing as, right? I mean, the star is technically still glow, and the glow in moss still glows, but it just doesn't glow as much. You know what I mean? So that's my dilemma. Trying to figure out exactly what time of day I should save the DA. Let me know your thoughts. You know, 5 in the morning, 6.37ish at night, or during the day. All right, another dilemma. No, it's not a dilemma. It's it's okay. What are you doing, Eloise? Why, hello. I take it you're done giving me the silent treatment? What was I supposed to think, my dear? You run into Walt the Island and not a writ of hello? You know, it's okay to drop by and say hi without any particular reason. I'm always happy to chat with you. I'm sorry. I didn't have a reason to talk to you then. I just said hi. I'm so I'm sorry. Uh, we have benches now. Okay. My bad. All right, let's get in here. Woo! What are we doing in here? Okay, I finished Appy on Paradise so I could get the catalog so I could access more items. But I also finished Appy on Paradise. I'm alone on this one, aren't I? I know what you're thinking. Andy, this is a bad idea. You don't have self-control. I know. Each house has what? It's a six by six. There's, there's like 32 tiles or something like that. And you have no self-control and there's four walls. And I, I hear you. I hear you. Back up. I hear you. I'm going to do it anyways. <laughs> I, I, I'm going to control myself. I'm not, I'm not going to do that much. I'm not. You'll see. You'll see. Come over here, Tom Nook. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. You can't stop me. Ah, ah, Andy, hello, hello. We're doing it. We're doing it. Let's talk ohms. Of course, of course. Let's talk about them. You can discuss your own ohm or suggest designs to one of the other residents. Which will it be? We're gonna, we're gonna talk designs. Oh, you'd like to pitch some new designs to a resident? We can certainly arrange that. <laughs> This is a good idea. It's a good, it's a good idea. We're going to start it off easy, okay? We're going to start it off easy and we're going to go into Stella's house. Hey, Stella. And that what covers it. What do you think? Are you interesting Andy with your home? Oh, yes, please. I can't wait to see what my redecorated home will be like. Bada bing. See, Stella thinks it's a good idea. So we're going to do it. <laughs> All right, see, Stella's house is going to be so easy. Like, look how cute it is already. We don't need to do anything, right? Let's do this. So my master plan is to get the tape recorders in the houses, right? Okay, not so obvious. We're going to hide them. So we are going to have to move some stuff around just a little bit. So, you know, we can hide them or hide the, the tape recorder. It's not, it's not as crazy as it looks. We just... We just need to hide them a little bit, right? Maybe we could give her, you know, an an extra chair, an extra chair, so she can have company and stuff, right? Something really simple and cute. Just a just just a little just a little reorganization, right? Just just a little bit. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get rid of that radio. <laughs> so we get the the chair in here, you know, just something really cute. Just get a little a little rearrangey. A little rearrangey. I, I don't know why she has a sink. And maybe that was a little too hasty to hide the tape recorder back there. But we can hide it. We can hide it. It'll be fine. I promise. Maybe get one of these to, to hide it a little better. Right? It's just in the corner there. Maybe get her some cute little flowers. Get her a purple carpet in here so it's nice. A pink little couch. You know, just to just to hang out in on or something like that. Simple stuff. We're gonna get a wall, <laughs> block her bedroom off, give her a little privacy with one of those, right? We're not gonna go overboard. We can get rid of that. Get her a cute little fireplace. Cause it's Stella, you know, she likes her flowers. Get her a couple of those. Maybe this bamboo sphere, cause it's cute. I'll move the carpet. Move the carpet over. And I don't have much, so there's not a lot that I can go through. I'm not convincing you. You're like, oh no, she's far gone. That's it. Cute little mat, rug, and that's it for that. And we're gonna go to the walls. Don't worry, the, don't worry, don't worry. The walls are gonna be really simple. What I wanna do for at each and every house is not only have the tape recorder, but also a surveillance camera kind of just in there back there. It's poorly hidden behind that uh, plant there, but it's surveillance camera for Graham. And then I have this decal here 
glow-in-the-dirt stickers and I either want to get a little bit of glowing moss, you know, just kind of hidden somewhere, you know, there's a little bit there in the corner and we'll get some glow, right, some toxic glow kind of close to the tape recorder and it's just kind of hidden and that's it, okay? Now we're done. We are done with Stella's place. I think, I think this is good. That's it. See? I didn't go overboard, did I? Well, not really. Well, that's the Stella's house. It was so easy. That's why I started easy. Get myself in the zone. Let's do the exterior. Let's see. I might change the exterior a little bit. Oh, we got the purple roof. Oh, there's the purple door. We got these come in different colors. Purple one. See? And that's it. And then we say yes. All right. I'm done. I'm done. See? I'm done. See? All right, and now we're going to do another house. That that wasn't so bad. That wasn't so bad. We're going to do Violet next. Yep. Let's do this. Okay, tape recorder. I'll get the surveillance camera out first and the glow stickers since I'll just get a couple of them. And then we're going to figure this out. Violet is clearly fancy. So maybe a piano. I'm going to get rid of that. We don't need that. All right, she's got this bathroom thing happening here. And I think it's super weird that I put the video camera by her bathroom. So I'm gonna move that. I mean, Graham's a creep, but I don't think he's that much of a creep. You know what I mean? Like, he's a creepy dude, but not that bad. I'm gonna move this over. And now we gotta figure out where we're gonna put the tape recorder. Okay, not right front and center. Possibly put it back here. We'll get this big plant. It's not that big, but it's it's big enough. I'm going to make that black because Violet's pretty fancy like that. Then I'm going to get this kind of plant. Oh, I have an idea. All right, that is not great. So I'm actually going to move this over on this side. Switch these all like so. Get the plant in there. So she's got this like little plant corner. Or we do like so. Take the tape recorder stick it back here maybe get some cactuses oh we got mama bear oh mama bear is cute okay so something like this and we'll give her a mama bear with a cute little purple shirt that's hiding the ca the recorder back there get rid of this copy the wall over to this side and i'll get a pillar and a pillar there we go and that's her like little quarters there piano uh, you know what? No. I'll get her another one of these consoles, like so, with a TV on it. Get her a rose rug. So the one that's called white is kind of just purple. And then I just got to do the move the glow in moss. Actually make it glow in moss. So we'll just get rid of that. Copy it and stick it there. All right, I actually have these rose things. So I'm just going to get these around to make it look, you know, less suspicious, right? A little plant corner, the baby bear. All right, Violet's house. Perfect. She's going to love it. She's going to love it. Let's do the exterior. Violet's exterior is really nice already. She could have a black house instead. Blue roses on the door. And that's it. Yes, I'm done. All right, next. We'll do Eloise next. All right, Eloise, let's go. And to think she was so mad at me a minute ago. All right, see, Eloise's place is looking pretty sharp too. Just gonna make a couple of changes. Get some bear stools in here with some cute yellow things. And then we gotta find a place to hide. Oh, we could put it on top of the fridge. Oh, it's that fridge you can't put stuff on. We're gonna fix that. This fridge comes in yellow. Yep, it's your new fridge, girl. It's not suspicious, don't worry about it. I'm gonna get her a bookshelf. It just doesn't seem right. Why doesn't Eloise have a bookshelf? I don't, I don't understand. Who planned this? Who did this? We're gonna go with the wall stuff. Get the security camera up here. Oh, I think that's okay. It's not in it at all, but it's okay. We're gonna get always some stacked up books, right? Fragrance diffuser. Cause she needs this. It's essential. They don't have yellow ones. There's no yellow curve. Oh, there's one. Get her counter. Like so. Get that fragrance diffuser over there. Cause it looks nicer. And then we're gonna get her glowing moss. Oh, that's an airplane. That ain't right. Now one. Alright, 
I think that's good. Actually, I'm just gonna change that to the regular one. I think it'll match up better, and it does. Perfect. All right, done skis. Hello. I guess we could look at the exterior as well. Our house is yellow. Let's check out the doors. I think that cute like white door and then a reef on it. I think those are good changes. Yep. And we're done. Yep. Next. All right, we're going to do Vladimir. I don't even know what's happening in Vladimir's house. I have no idea. Why is your house a construction zone, Vladimir? I guess we'll never know. Okay, Vladimir's house might take a little bit longer. This is not a house. What is this, Vladimir? Oh my gosh. We're just gonna we're just gonna change some of this stuff. Just a little bit. Like the pylons. What why? We don't need that radio. I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna stick it like that. It's coming different colors. Gray and black. He's got a sewer drain. Oh my gosh, Vladimir, come on, man. Get rid of that. Clearly likes to be Andy and he's working on something. So I guess we'll get like a tool shelf out for him. Let's get this workbench because it comes in. No, it doesn't. All right, we'll do white. And we're gonna stick it in there. I guess he could have his vending machine. All right, these chairs come in pink. So I'm gonna give him one of those. I'm gonna get him this console. Yeah, it comes in bright pink. And I think that's just good like that. I'm gonna get this couch because it comes in pink. This doesn't make sense. But then again, Vladimir's house doesn't make sense. So I'm going to put the living room this way, like that. He's got his vending machine. Why, Vladimir? Why? I'm going to get this table. I guess it'll match up. Get him to watch one of these. I got to change the walls. I'm sorry. He can't live like this. Hold that. No, he can't live like that either. Hold this. No. This? Vladimir, why? Pink sailboats. Perfect. And then we'll just make the floor a little artier, I suppose. Yeah. There we go. Red wavy rug. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. I think I'm just gonna switch this around just a bit. Put it back like that. Get a chair in here. And some fishing rods. Because he likes fishing. One there. And another one. Now, I am really tempted to get a flamingo in here. Yep. I am. Oh yeah, okay, we got, oh, we got both flamingos. Okay, we got Mrs. Flamingo and Mr. Flamingo. Got these paint cans. Ooh, that one has like bright pink in it. Can I put stuff on this? Oh, I can. Well, okay. Get a gnome. Is there a pink gnome? No. Okay, maybe he's in here crafting garden things. Yeah, so he's just in here. That's what he's doing. He's just crafting gnomes and garden bunnies and, and stuff like that. Maybe I'll get him a pink garden bunny and some gnomes. I'm going to get him his generic beer bottles as well. You know, he's still, he's still drinking. So that's what Vladimir is doing in here. I like that. He's just super grumpy and he just makes garden stuff. And he really likes gnomes and flamingos. Doesn't like anything else, you know? That's why he's so cranky. He's like, leave me to my garden stuff. There's the tape recorder. That's way better <laughs> hidden than Eloise's place. I think Graham just gave up when it came to Eloise. He's like, oh, she's just like a stinky elephant. She don't know what's going on. Okay, Graham's elves. That took a bit longer, but to be fair, Graham's elves was sad before we got here. I'm going to give him this red dotted accent wall too. Okay. I like this. I like this idea. I like this house a lot better. I mean, we try to stay true to it by keeping that stuff. And I guess he's like just constructing garden stuff. And that's his little hobby. That's why his lawn looks the way it does. Which I will be adding gnomes to. I ordered gnomes. I'm just going to do the exterior. I think I like this one better. Try the roof. Black maybe? He's a pink. Oh, and it's like a little portal. Unless we do like a pink, pink roof. Yeah, okay. I think I like this house a lot better. Okay, I'm done. Next. All right, now we're gonna do sprinkle. All right, sprinkle cutie patootie. I don't think our house needs too much work. I think I will change the ice theme that's going on. That's pretty cute. Or what about blue? Oh, that's a, yeah, blue. Kind of like this floor. And then I'm going to, yeah, I'm just going to get rid of the ice stuff. Pay homage to it and give her an ice carpet. All with that. Nice summer shell rug. I think it's going to be pretty easy to hide this recorder, like, just behind her bed. And then maybe we'll bring the fan palms in on either side. Just make it, like, super cute. And she's, like, totally fab, right? So she's going to need uh, a makeup 
area. So that's a lamp. What is this? A radio? That's okay. Try this curtain divider. Does that come in sprinkle colors? This one kind of does. Put it over there. I want to get the shell table in here, right? Maybe this chair. Oh, that's nice. That can go in front of our makeup thing. What colors does this come in? Oh, it comes in sprinkle blue. We can get snowflakes in here just to, you know, she likes snowflakes. And then I'm gonna give her a cute little blue shovel. And this is for when she goes out in the beach and digs up sea life so she can paint them. I'm gonna get the fountain out of here. And then we'll have this little pot set there. That come in like some cute colors. That's kind of cute. This chair comes in blue. I'll put the table in the corner. I'll have the chair over here and the other chair over here. Yep. That's fab. Get the security camera in here, in the corner, and some glowing moss. Probably back here a little bit. And that's it. This is cute. I like it. Done skis. We're not doing our exterior. It's perfect. I am done. All right, next. Kyle, you're up. All right, let's go, Normie. All right, so Kyle's house is going to be quite normal. I don't think I'm going to give him any glowing moss. He's not being affected by the contaminant because he doesn't drink the water or eat the food on this island because he's just too good for that because he's smug. And I think it's going to be pretty easy to hide this because he's just got all this music stuff anyways. I think I'm going to change the floor and the wallpaper bit of this one. That seems like really Kyle. This one? Oh, the red one looks better. I like the red one. It's just like a lot warmer in here all of a sudden. We're going to get um, a sloppy couch because, you know, he's just like this weird bachelor guy. You can get a thing. I'm going to get a homework set. It's like he writes his music on there. Get um, some earphones, a sloppy table, you know, where he has all of his music that he uh, doesn't like because it wasn't great. So more instruments, turntable. We're definitely going to get records in here and we'll get a rug. I don't know what the shaggy rug. Yeah, that works. Starry Skies rug. Yeah, it's kind of smug angst, I suppose. All right. So no glowing moss, but we are going to be surveilling him because I guess he's like the control unit <laughs> for Crab's research. And I think that's it. Not a lot of changes. Not a lot of changes at all. We're doing good. All right. Exterior, please. Now, I don't really like the side paneling. I'm thinking you'd have like a pretty solid door. I think the roofing is okay. I think I'm going to go for a black stucco and this metal iron door plate. All right. That's it. We're done. All right. Next. Okay, now we're gonna do Buck's Place. All right, partner, let's do this. I don't mind it. It looks pretty cool. You know, he plays with trains and he's got some toy stuff. Uh, the flooring is a little juvenile. I don't think that Buck style, the green. Buck might be, you know, a little, a little silly, but I think he's got his head on his shoulders. He takes care of all these pigs. Maybe not so well, but he, he does it, right? Is this good? I think that's all right. I don't know why he has a fan or the cardboard box. I don't like this jukebox either. Okay. So he's just got his train set. I'm assuming he'd have like a really simple bed. A little sloppy. Does Buck read? I don't think Buck reads. I'm going to get him a leather sofa. That seems legit. I'm going to move this stuff over so I can get the tape recorder in the corner there. Get it right in there. I'm going to get the A bed in here. Because I'm going to get a piggy in here. Maybe two. I'm going to turn them blue. Maybe I'll turn that one red. Because Buck has noticed that his pigs are turning. He's noticed. And he's he's got these guys in here. Because he's worried about them. Meanwhile, there's the other piggies that are out in the burn eating all that stuff. He hasn't noticed that yet. But he's noticed these guys. Definitely getting a brown cow rug in here. Because he's a rancher. How big is this? Oh, it's pretty big. I move this one up. Get the security camera in here. Up there. Yeah, this is good. Buck's place. You know what? I'm going to get this log bench. Get some wood on there. And a ukulele. Get a little bucket beside the coach. I'm going to get the glowing moss in here. In the corner over here. And then I'm going to bring it over here. 
And I think that's good. I think that's his Buck's house. Can I walk around? Is it good? Is it fine? I can walk around. Oh, I guess we could put a little side table for him. Or just one of these wardrobes. Because I think it comes in green. It does. There we go. Yeah, I think that brings it together. Oh, a straw wall. Cute. All right. Denskis. Do the exterior. We could get an orange roof. And a little orange and green. Oh, that's nice. Put some mushrooms. Oh, I forgot to put a shell reef on Sprinkle's door. That's okay. All right. Next. Now let's go. Next, next, next. Okay. Now we're going to do broccolo. Come on. Look at this is mouse. This is mouse. There are some things I don't like about this interior. It's definitely having a slide inside and a perk bench. But other than that, it's pretty cute. It's super broccolo, right? We can get him a rocket ship. A blue rocket ship, the tape recorder in the corner, and we'll move the toys. Maybe a blue bookshelf with a Nintendo Switch, because he's adorable. He's got this little painting corner. It's so cute. I'm going to change the floor to try and get him a little drum so he can play drums. He's got his own popcorn machine. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Should we get some of these pipes in here? This doesn't make any sense. I don't care. I'm doing it. We got a barrel in here. Maybe a couple. Oh, pop a bur. A little pop a bur in here. Oh, come on, please. Okay. Oh, a wi willowing machine for his wheat. I'm gonna get some sacked bakes in here. Then I think I'm just gonna get his beer just in and around. Okay. Aw. This this makes no sense. It's so cute though. Like there's firm stuff in here. Oh my gosh, I forgot about what we were doing. We are here. We are here to hide cameras. That's what we're here for. There's like a shaggy rug. Ooh, a cookie rug. There's no room. I'm putting it in. You can't stop me. Cookie rug. And a tree stump rug. Okay, this place doesn't make any sense. Sandy Beach. We screwed up on Sprinkles Place. We gotta go back. Field florin. Grass florin. Oh, okay. Maybe grass florin. Yeah, okay. This is cute with the little accent wall. Perfect. Dunskies. Oh, wait, let's do the exterior. This house is so cute, but I'm gonna make it a cabin. Got this blue roof, which I think goes a lot better. And this blue door. Yeah, that's so cute. Okay, duns. All right, next. Charlie's. I don't think I'm gonna change much about Charlie's place except just add the thing. Hey, Charlie's. I could do it. Oh, I'm gonna change the walls. Yeah, the white bird walls. Cause that's depressing. She's just training for whatever Graham says. So I'm gonna get a bunch of security cameras in the corner. So there's a security camera in every corner. I'm gonna put a bench press, a pull up bur for training. She got a cot, that's all right. We're gonna go with the walls. I wanna see if this is gonna look good. It's okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a pattern of this goo. Very, very gooey wall. All right, I'm gonna change this stuff up and make the pieces match together. All right, that should do it. There's a big goo on the wall. And Graham is not going to be recording Charlie's. He can't even handle her going all the time. So he just doesn't record her. We're going to play in the exterior. Our house exterior is very nice and we don't want that. So I'm just going to make it look like a shack. Does this look like jail doors? That looks like jail doors. Okay. Yeah. Done skis. All right. Last one. Doing Graham. All right, Graham. Let's hide that basement. Oh, it's so creepy. I want to add a couple things. I definitely want to get rid of that bookshelf. Anything that looks remotely human. I'm gonna get just more equipment. I'm gonna get the video camera. I'm gonna put it over here because he'll like do his stuff and then he'll like talk into the camera while he's, you know, talking about his research. I'm gonna get a fax machine. Well, at least it's a printer. A brainstorming bird maybe? <laughs> or this. This looks like a little crazier. Yeah, I like that. Gotta get surface. I'm gonna get the desktop mic on here so, you know, he can record himself. Glowing moss jurors, definitely. He's just, you know, collecting samples. 
office materials chemistry set right up in front this thing supplies fire extinguisher because you know safety we have this that we could put inside yeah okay we can do that yeah okay we could have that as his desk all the office supplies and the extinguisher we're gonna need a super evil chair because he's super evil it's just true okay fire extinguishers is getting awkward so i'm just gonna do this i guess we'll have like a study st or a stool not a study stool just a swivel stool for his research over here oh medicine cabinet that's a good one we're gonna have the camera there glowing moss on that office plus up on here we're gonna move this move this up get the medicine cabinet back there in an eviler color like gray fax machine fax machines are just evil i don't know if you ever had trouble with a fax machine but it's not a good time oh and the glowing moisture shelf oh that is so good we're gonna get a skinnier table oh evil work desk oh with documents on it maybe because he's like out of control man get rid of that i'm gonna get this up there glowing moss shelf back there oh yeah if this is not an evil lair i don't know what is so we're gonna do we're gonna bring the girls down a bit so you can see them better you know what i'm gonna move up to this side and then i'll have the posters center like so oh yeah this is awesome that's so awesome get the globe because he's trying to take over the world and then i think i'm just gonna fill that up with more glowing moss oops i did not mean to do that much change some of the colors i like the floors i think the floors are creepy what about the sloppy rug protective rug kind of like that yep okay this is awesome this is creepy it's awesome graham is evil he's doing experiments on people and he's recording all the evidence right here right here he's just logging in into his computer he's got facts he's got stuff he's got everything everything in this th 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 there's room because he's evil oh all right all right i'm done i think the exterior of graham's house is just fine so i'm all done you've done your part and now it's time for me to do mine i'll work with graham and so we can start <laughs> he's in on it tom nook is in on it i knew it who would let anyone put that many security cameras and tape recorders all over their island if they weren't in on it everything should be just like we talked about tomorrow be sure to drop by and see how it came out yeah you know he's in on it he's in on it okay let's see all the exteriors turned out woohoo i'm so excited okay i'll kyle's place kyle's place looks good looking good all right next oh yeah violet's place looks so cute i think it matches up i think this looks nice next and come up to buck's place oh yeah buck's place matches in now it looks it looks like it belongs in the orange and green area i like it okay stella's new purple door pretty much the same but more purple love it Ooh, graham's in there working in his lab oh gosh he's so creepy you're so creepy are you gonna go sit in the evil chair are ya welcome to the new chamber de graham of course you designed the place so you know what it's all about. but with mirror it's finally complete that is so evil you're so evil graham anyway make yourself at home kick up your feet you've more than earned it indeed oh my god did i just get an evil mastermind pat on the back Ugh, no oh no what have we done what have we done right, let's get in here let's see see how charlise's place yeah charlise's place looks sad i might change her exterior that it it's not as it doesn't look as shacky it's not great okay i'm gonna change that later and i'm also gonna add a stir fish reef to sprinkle and change your floor to sand probably so i'll do that later tonight oh brock Lowe's new blue door and his flowers oh his little roof his roof's a little bluer it's cute it's cute uh Louise's place with her new white door that looks nice this house oh wow doesn't that look like a burby house perfect vladimir is probably loving it he's probably loving it yay okay this is good this is good stuff it's good yay yay all right oh they're friends okay 
Well, thank you so much for hanging out with me today and remodeling everyone's house. I am going to make those two changes to Charlie's and Sprinkle's place. And don't forget to let me know what you think about the time of day. And I'll see you tomorrow. And if tomorrow's episode is up, it'll be on the screen right now for you. And I will see you then. Cheers.